So so far we've learned how to um, how to overlay different video layers, uh, how to manipulate the timeline, dragging dragging video clips around. All these clips can be moved afterwards. They can be put um, so they they run one after the other on the same the same timeline and so on. Uh, it's pretty pretty straightforward to control uh, what's going on here. Um, we're going to add some some titling in next. So at the start of the video, uh, I want to have a, a title for the movie. Um, if we head up to our effects library here, click on that, there's a whole bunch of different effects that we can use. Um, we'll be using these transitions in a second. If you've got a couple of video clips uh, side by side, you can choose how the clip um, one clip moving, moves into the next using some kind of dissolve or a wipe. Um, in this case, we want some titling. I just want some plain text. And I want it sitting. Oops. There we are. So I'm going to put it on the same uh, the same video track as the, as the robot. Because uh, we've, we've got some space here. There's no, there's no need to have a, a, a fourth video track here. If I, um, if I click on it. So it's highlighted. Then in the inspector panel over here, um, we can start to play around with the font, the size, the position, and so on. I'm going to move my scrubber so it's in the middle of that section, so we can see what the titling looks like. And at the moment, it's centered on the screen. Um, we want to. I'm going to move that down. See, my machine's a bit laggy. There we are. I'm going to pick a, a different font and I'm going to put the title in. So Pokemon Gone is my title. Um, okay, I'm going to just move the size. All right, not quite centered. Machine so slow. All right, it's um it's a bit of a pale background, so uh, we can also do things like adding in a, a drop shadow. If I pop that in there, you can see the shadow sits behind it. Just lifts the the titling up a bit too far, and you know you, you can tweak until your heart's content with fonts, colors, and so on. Um, now. At the moment, at the start of my movie, the titling is going to be there. It's going to get to this point here, and it's going to instantly disappear. If I hit play, it's a, and it's a bit jarring to see things just disappear like that. So what I'm going to do is add a transition at the start and end of, of that titling. Um, I'm just going to use uh, a cross dissolve here. I'm going to pop one at the start and one at the end. So that's going to have the effect of fading in the title and then fading it out at the other side. All right. Let's see if we can preview this so it fades in. Fades out. Every good movie needs to have some credits at the end. So we're also gonna add that in. Um, if you go to the to the titles here, I'm gonna use a scrolling text. I'm just gonna attach it at the end of that timeline here. Click on it. I'm gonna put my scrubber in the middle just so we can see how it looks. Um, so I'm gonna align it centered and Pokemon gone. Oops. Starring. Uh, Pikachu. A big robot. Um, directed by me. Produced by me. 
edited by me. Um, copyright 2017. Copy films. All good. So you can see that scrolling through at the end there. Okay, final thing is um, we need a little bit of uh, music as the credits roll. So I've got this little Pac-Man theme tune here. I'm going to chuck that on the end of, of that audio track here. And I'm just going to pull back the the scrolling credits here so it's the same the same duration as the music. And we should be done. So, um, yeah, the preview's not gonna work so well on this machine. It's struggling a bit, but you'll get the idea. So, fade in, fade out. There's our robot. good um, there's a billion more things this software can do um, there's an awful lot of online help if you want to know how to do particular things um, there's various videos and there's a huge manual you can download that has uh, pretty good guides into to various to various things but in terms of basic editing putting clips side by side putting transitions between them um, putting titling on that's that's all you need to know